Hi Taurus, so welcome to your daily reading. So let's go ahead and take a look at what you need to know today. What does Taurus need to know today? Hope you're having a great day so far and looking forward to a wonderful weekend. All right, let's have a look. Four of Swords. So Four of Swords is telling me that some of you may be feeling quite exhausted. Four of Swords is kind of a bit like chronic fatigue where you're chronically tired and you really need a break because you've been doing so much. Okay, you know, and it, it's kind of giving me the vibe that you've got more that needs to be done as well. Um, so King of Cups, King of Cups is either a water sign, male, Cancer, Pisces or a Scorpio. Alternatively, a very family orientated male. Someone who loves the kids, grandkids or nieces and nephews has a really good relationship with their mum and dad or, you know, just their family in general okay this person is a very emotionally intelligent person okay they follow their heart with all their decisions okay very loving and caring now next up we have three of pentacles this could be an interview or a meeting of some sort it could be involving a water sign male it could be to do with work okay a meeting about feeling really tired and overworked with the king of cups now alternatively you could be having a meeting with the king of cups um, that is very fatigued and tired okay so i need to look further into this and see what the next situation is so this is tired in regards to possibly plans for the future king of cups wants to turn things around wants to make some big changes or perhaps this king of cups is going through some major changes in their life now if you are the masculine you may be the king of cups at this point very emotional at the at this time feeling very connected to your family and loved ones so three of pentacles and the three of cups it's really saying having a meeting where we're going to start having some conversations with really important people now um, it's kind of giving me the vibe of going to um, you know, for some of you, I'm getting the vibe where you're preparing for an engagement or an event like a birthday. You're preparing um, for some kind of function like it, it's giving me visions of people going taste testing wedding cakes or um, things like that. Going and um, looking, you know, having interviews or meetings with prospective um wedding planners or people who want to plan a birthday or something like that some kind of event um, because this is like kind of got that financial um, undertone with the pentacles or something that is to do with resources and this is a celebration or some kind of important event to get together with some um, very close knit people that that you know okay feeling quite tired but anticipating something in the future king of cups turns things around to do with some kind of meeting to that maybe costs money or to do with money also an observation we're kind of looking at something here even house hunting or something along those lines and this could even be a housewarming party now why does the king of cups change things and turn things around this could be to do with work eight of pentacles is all about work and something that we are working on okay eight of cup uh, eight of pentacles is someone who is very proficient and competent at their work as well very good at what they do hmm very nice and queen of wands so queen of wands fire sign female 
uh, Aries Leo or a Sagittarius. Now, if it's not a fire sign female, sometimes I show up and I'm a Taurus sun. So I show up as a queen of wands at times um, due to my um, fire in my rising and my Venus. So some of you may have fire in your charts, just like, you know, the masculine may have water in their chart. Alternatively, it could be a water sign male that is around you, whether you're male or female and a fire sign female. Alternatively, this could be you showing up as someone quite spiritual, maybe a little bit short-tempered at this time because maybe someone is not giving you the attention that you want, okay? Because Queen of Wands tends to really love attention and she only kind of shows up in a reading if, it's, um, if she needs to sort of, be a little um, assertive in regards to what she wants. It's like, I really want more attention from you or I really want more of something. Um, and so she's asserting her, her power here with the wand and and her, I guess, her mysterious self, kind of like not wanting to put forward um, what she wants or what is needed in regards to making something happen because she feels that it should be something that should be automatic. It's almost like a partner shouldn't have to be told or asked to express their feelings. They should just want to do it automatically. So the Queen of Wands will show up if, if somebody is not asserting, uh, you know, kind of uh, confirming themselves in a connection, specifically a relationship. So she may be showing up, asserting herself, saying, you know, look, I really, you know, want this to work, but you need to be able to step up for this to happen. So the King of Cups may need to turn things around with the Queen of Wands on some level. Hope that makes sense for you. And a King of Pentacles, ooh, Okie dokie. So we've got another king. So king of pentacles, earth sign, male, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. It could be you, Taurus, if you are the male. King of pentacles is someone who is in the financial spectrum of things. So he could be a banker, a business owner, a loans officer, someone who is all about the money and resources. So this person is going to be showing up at this meeting and there's going to be a celebration. The Three of Cups could be these two and this king. So it could literally be a love triangle in some cases. So I need to clarify who is who here. So I'll ask the tarot who is the king of cups for well, my taurus who is okay so we have the element of sharing um also six of pentacles is very interesting because it means that we are portioning our time and our energy um towards this um person so it's like i am giving of myself only you know a fraction to this person because i am also sharing my time and my you know my myself me i'm sharing me with some some other situation that is a six of pentacles could be sharing money sharing time sharing thought sharing energy on some level now let's have a look who the queen of pentacles is she is most likely to be Taurus female watching this alternatively it could be another female there we go um ooh, uh, this queen of wands may be a mum because six of cups is children now alternatively six of wands could be someone who's reminiscing the past okay it could also be saying this king is um, displaying that kind of attention towards the queen of wands that i said portioning their time towards her and this is why she's asserting her power with the wand and she's kind of um you know kind of sending out the energy of you know you should be 
stepping up in this connection as opposed to portioning your attention towards me okay and she may be reminiscing um, what it was like in regards to a connection that they had the king of cups may have been showing her a lot more love and attention and energy um, and she's probably kind of stuck in that time frame in her in her uh, thoughts like about what once was with this king okay so the wheel of fortune could be saying that the king has changed um, randomly now let's have a look at the king of pentacles who is this this is oh it's reversed so ten of swords reversed means a delayed end uh, an ending that is delayed it is um taking longer than what it should um, perhaps this king is delaying something okay so um it also could be saying that this uh connection between the queen and the king here um ended a long time ago and she may be reminiscing about him too okay so let's go ahead and get some more tarot and see what other messages there are um, in regards to um i guess the sharing the reminiscing or children and the ten of swords so this one again but i wanted to ask about this king ten of um, cups and suddenly changed so either they shared children together because six of cups came through again alternatively reminiscing about the happy times but things changed so regardless things have changed between this king and this queen all right so you know and they're both kind of reminiscing happy times now tell me about the queen justice reversed she feels that she's been done wrong by okay justice reversed means kind of like in an injustice um has either gone towards her so this king may have done the wrong thing by this queen so tell me about the king of pentacles with the ten of swords what is the king of pentacles with the ten of swords please there we go um queen of swords Ooh. queen of swords he may be going through a separation or he has gone through a separation either with an air sign female aquarius libra gemini um alternatively you know he may have gone through a separation a while ago and this is his ex okay so i need to give you more info so what i'm going to do is use the finder sequel keeper fate lenormand mix to give you some more info we have the female okay she's reminiscing and thinking then we have a meeting that could be either the three of pentacles or three of cups and oh about the lover or a friend but they're not facing each other so they're not in um they're not i guess either they don't know each other or they're they're rivals or frenemies kind of thing um so yeah they're not in good stance and there's a meeting between them um in regards to some major blockages that are not changing in regards to legalities okie dokie uh, in regards to legalities and love so um they may be she may be having a meeting uh, in regards to her and the blockages that are not changing with legalities and love so that is what's coming through okay let's go ahead and get the gypsy oracle and see what guidance your angels and guides have for you 
um, someone is hanging out to be with you, going through a very vulnerable time. However, things are progressing with the wife. Um, so that could be the King of Pentacles or the King of Cups. Now, um, prog uh, yeah, progressing with the wife. So our Lord would be the male is thinking of, what's he thinking of? Um, the lover or being the lover in pursuit of you if you are the female. Um, okay, the love, pursuing the young woman, um, but things are very challenging and he's looking into, he's um, asking for guidance about a third party cheerfulness or to date you to you know he may even yeah he may be asking for guidance to um take you out you know maybe asking am i allowed to see someone new during this process old woman is responsibilities surprise um so they are really surprised this could be a workplace romance for some of you um you know with merchant you know this is they're surprised that they can um i think there's you know more than anything the message is coming through they're surprised by how much they enjoy your company if you're the female if you're the male you're surprised by how connected you feel to this um feminine um and negotiations with foe, negotiations with, you know, I guess their, their soon-to-be ex or their ex in regards to how things should pan out in the future in regards to maybe a separation. All right, so that's as far as I'm going to go. It's a general reading and it's gone for nearly 17 minutes. So I hope you enjoyed it and I hope it gave you some light and guidance in regards to your situation. Comment below, let me know how it resonated. Please give me a like and don't forget to subscribe if you would like to support my channel. And as always, I send you love, peace and light. Bye for now.